A virus that hasn't been seen for years in dogs is suddenly appearing again in one of our mountain counties. Canine distemper has no cure and it's deadly. News 13's Rex Hodge is live at the Junaluska Animal Hospital in Haywood County. And Rex, this has both vets and pet owners worried. Very much so. It has animal hospitals here on alert. They're not sure what's causing the outbreak. They are sure about the best way to avoid it, and that is to get your dogs vaccinated every year. Can we listen to your heart? This is a healthy dog being examined at Junaluska Animal Hospital. But Dr. Jeffrey Alt says they've seen five cases of distemper in dogs in the last three weeks. We don't know exactly uh, why we're having somewhat of an outbreak. The result is not usually a good one. Three have died. This is definitely alarming. Dr. Alt says canine distemper is a virus, often starting with watery eyes and a watery nose and fever. Primarily it affects the respiratory system, but it can also affect gastrointestinal, the uh, neurologic system for sure, so it can create tremors and seizures. He says rural, outside dogs are more at risk of catching the virus, which is airborne. We think it could be a reservoir of wild animals, like uh, possibly uh, raccoons or, or foxes. Um, the virus can also be harbored by skunks. He's just a very sweet little dog. Harry Lecky came by Junaluska Animal Hospital with a lost dog he found in the Caruso area, wanting to make sure he's healthy and knowing full well the dangers of distemper. Everybody better get the dogs vaccinated because otherwise you're going to lose them. And once you really get sick, sometimes it's hard to bring them back. Dr. Alt says the distemper vaccine is effective and key to avoiding the virus for which there is no antidote. We need to be getting these uh, patients vaccinated. <laughs> The outbreak is changing procedures at Sarge's Animal Rescue. We're stepping up sanitation protocols. We are definitely emphasizing the importance of continued vaccine protocols. That message now more than ever being given to adopting families. And because their immune systems are still developing, Dr. Alt says it's especially important to get puppies vaccinated against distemper. Reporting live tonight from Haywood County, Rex Hodge, News 13.